so we will start with the first problem it will show that z6 the additive group of integers modulo 6 forms a group with respect to addition modulo 6 so this group is actually denoted by z6 so we are going to in this exercise we are going to show that z6 forms a group and we know the elements of z6 are 0 bar 1 bar 2 bar 3 bar 4 bar and 5 bar because 6 bar is again treated as 0 so for this we will first prepare a table of our addition so we are going to use your operation is addition modulo 6 so operation will be modulo 6 addition so we are going to do that now I will prepare a table which will have entries as 0 bar 1 bar 2 bar 3 bar 4 bar 5 bar and 0 bar 1 bar 2 bar 3 bar 4 bar 5 bar and the operation is addition modulo 6 so I'm going to add 0 plus 0 which will be 0 bar here 0 plus 1 so this is 0 plus 1 is 1 bar 0 plus 2 is 2 bar 3 bar 4 bar and 5 bar and in the next line 1 bar plus 0 bar this is 1 bar and this is 0 bar 1 bar plus 0 bar is 1 bar 1 bar plus 1 bar is 2 bar this is 3 bar 4 bar 5 bar and 1 bar plus 6 bar 1 bar plus 5 bar is 6 bar but 6 bar is 0 bar so I will write here 6 0 bar similarly 7 bar will be again 1 bar in Z6 we know this so now next line is 2 bar plus 0 bar is 2 bar 3 bar 4 bar 5 bar 0 bar and 2 bar plus 5 bar is 7 bar which is 1 bar I will complete this table in this fashion and uh, you see that it is not very difficult to do this table so this completes the table of addition modulo 6 so let me clear those arrows and signs now here we have used these things 6 bar plus 0 bar 7 bar is 1 bar 8 bar will become 2 bar and so on so this is what we have used okay so if you take any two elements of z6 so let me write closure so if a belongs to if any element belongs to z6 and b bar also belongs to z6 and then the above table says that addition of any two elements in z6 that addition again comes to be an element which is in z6 only so if a bar and b bar belong to z6 then the above table shows that that a bar plus b bar also belongs to z6 so the closure property is clearly satisfied then second is associativity so associativity is easy to check so I will leave it as an exercise for you 
So this addition is modulo 6. So I will write modulo 6. This is always equal to a bar plus b bar plus c bar. So this associativity holds. The reason that one actually always gives is that uh, associativity holds in integers. So it will also hold in z6 here. So the next is third property is identity. So identity here is we know that zero bar will be the identity because any element plus zero bar will again give you the same element so identity is zero bar and the last is inverse so every element must have inverse in the group so if i take the element can i write the inverse so a bar plus b bar should be zero zero is identity so this means that b bar is inverse of a bar so the elements are 0 bar 1 bar 2 bar 3 bar 4 bar 5 bar and 6 bar so the about table now will give you the inverses so when i go to the about table i see that 0 bar plus 0 bar is giving me 0 1 bar plus 5 bar is 0 bar 2 bar plus 4 bar is 0 bar then 3 bar plus 3 bar plus uh, 3 bar is 0 bar 4 bar plus 2 bar is also 0 bar and 5 bar plus 1 bar is also 0 bar so these are the inverses so this means that zero inverse of zero is zero why because zero bar plus zero bar is zero bar one bar inverse is five bar because one bar plus five bar came to be zero bar so from that above squared tables we will get two bar inverse is four bar and three bar inverse is three bar four bar inverse is two bar five bar inverse is one bar and 6 bar is not there so this are the this is the table of inverses okay so we have shown that every element has an inverse in this group so in this set so this means that z6 with respect to addition modulo 6 forms a group so the first exercise is, is over here now if you go for the second exercise the second exercise is z5 star now z5 star means all elements of z5 except 0 bar now it is 1 bar 2 bar 3 bar 4 bar so this is z5 star okay and in z5 we know that 5 bar is treated as 0 bar this set is a uh, uh, forms a group forms a group with respect to multiplication modulo 5 this is what is our exercise so show so okay this is my exercise so the solution of this exercise is again going to be the same as above so i'm going to know say that i'm going to say multiplication modulo 5 table i'm going to write the elements of z5 1 bar 2 bar 3 bar 4 bar and now I'm going to multiply them instead of adding now we have a multiplication operation and multiplication modulo 5 so 1 bar into 1 bar is 1 bar I'm going a little fast now 2 bar 3 bar 4 bar 2 multiplied by 1 is 2 bar 2 to the 4 to the 6 but 6 bar is 1 bar in Z5 so this will be 1 bar 2 for the 8 so modulo is 3 bar 3 6 is 1 bar 3 3 is a 9 which is 4 bar 12 which is 2 bar then 4 bar 3 bar 4 is a 12 which is 2 bar and 16 which is 1 bar so this is the table for multiplication modulo 5 so if you take any a bar from here 
and you choose any B bar from here you will see that A bar is from Z5 star and B bar is also in Z5 star so then obviously all these multiplications these are all A bar multiplied by B bar modulo 5 okay this is also in a non-zero element nobody came zero so that is also in Z5 star so this means that first property is that my closure holds from the table so from the table okay secondly associativity I will again leave it to you so associativity what is associativity a bar multiplied by b bar into c bar will be equal to a bar into b bar into c bar this is all multiplication modulo 5 sorry okay this can be checked third is the identity identity is uh, e is equal to 1 obviously because a in a bar into 1 bar is always equal to a bar so identity is 1 bar and the last thing is inverse a should be multiplied by b bar so that you will get identity but identity is 1 bar so this b is in b bar is inverse of a bar so if I write the elements in my table a bar as 1 bar 2 bar 3 bar and 4 bar these are elements of Z5 these are the inverses so how we check the inverses we will go back into the table and find out the identity wherever the identity came so 1 bar into 1 bar is 1 bar 2 bar into 3 bar is 1 bar 3 bar into 2 bar is also 1 bar and 4 bar into 4 bar is again 1 bar so 1 ka inverse is 1 inverse of 2 is 3 inverse of 3 is 2 and inverse of 4 is 4 itself so I will write it here so 1 bar 2 bar inverse is 3 bar 3 bar inverse is 2 bar and 4 bar inverse is 4 bar itself so every element here has inverse and therefore all our four things are satisfied and therefore I finally conclude that Z phi star with respect to multiplication modulo 5 forms a group so this finishes the second exercise